Welcome back guys. So today is a big day I've been waiting for. Today I actually get to trade in the Grand Cherokee, the Black Limited, 2015 Limited, and we're gonna be getting the 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee Trailhawk. So here's the last look at the 2015. This is gonna be going bye-bye today. I'm taking it to CarMax. Gonna trade it in on the white one. So I've taken all the lights out of it, interior lights and everything, got all back to stock, except for the uh, grill pieces, like I said in the last video. So what I gotta do right now is I'm just gonna do a real quick clean on the inside, vacuum it out a little bit, pull out the, uh, the mats, the all-weather mats, and that's the last thing remaining in the vehicle that I need to get out. That's my personal items. So we're gonna do that now, head to CarMax, Get this thing rolling. All right guys, so we're here at CarMax waiting for them to come out and do the evaluation on the truck so I can sell it. They've already given me my offer, I've accepted, and uh, this is how it goes. CarMax has been pretty easy to deal with. I haven't had any issues at all um, shipping the other vehicle to my location and then uh, trading this one in. So far it's been um, pretty what they said it was gonna be, super simple. So um, highly recommend it right now, but check out CarMax for your next vehicle. And I got a phone call from them telling me that my uh, new Grand Cherokee was in. However, this is Sunday evening and the sheriff has to do a VIN inspection on it. The sheriff doesn't come until the morning. So my vehicle won't be ready for pickup until tomorrow morning sometime. Um, but uh, they said I could come out and take a look at it. So now I'm walking down here to check it out and see if I can find it on the lot. But um, yeah, unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to pick it up. They thought they were gonna be able to get it done as soon as they could for me, but um, I'm down here now. It looks like they got the hood open. Let me flip you guys around and you can see it. All right, so I don't know why, but they got the hood open on it. I'm not sure what they're, what they're doing there, but uh, the battery was just disconnected for shipping or what, but here it is, guys. This is what it looks like. So Grand Cherokee Trailhawk right here. V6, that's what I ordered, definitely V6. Looks like it's in okay condition here. Let's check out the front bumper for any rock chips. Uh, no, it has not been drilled for the front plate either. It's a little dirty from shipping. Gonna have to clean that up. Looks like everything's in place. No condensation on the lights. No cracks in the lights, it looks like. That's good. Engine bay looks okay. Let's take a look down in here. Uh, looks all right. Nothing I see leaking. I don't see any fluid anywhere, any wetness anywhere. Typically the um, crank seals have issues. You have some leakage, some valve cover issues. I don't see any issues there. Uh, make sure you check these vehicles over. Vehicles over real good whenever you get a used vehicle, guys. So know what you're looking at. Know what you're looking for when you go to look at these. It's dirty. It's a dirty bitch. But uh, there it is. Doesn't look like it has any uh, scratches or dents, which is good. That's what they told me. So that's awesome. Um, don't know if I could pop open the trunk with the being so close to that other one. But looks like the back bumper is good. Trailer hitch. Doesn't look like the trailer hitch has ever been used. There's nothing on the inside there. Uh, that's just dirt right there, but there's no scraping like it's had a receiver in there at all. Nothing scraped on the back side of these where it's had any tow chains. So that's cool. Yeah, looks good. Uh, one thing I did notice is it has tinted windows. So it looks like the previous owner tinted the windows, which is cool. I don't have to worry about getting that done. So that's awesome. Let's get a good view of it here. That's what it looks like. There it is, so get it home, get the lift put on, the wheels and tires put on, the other parts and pieces that I have, but we're gonna open it up. He said it's unlocked. We'll check out the inside here too. You're looking down the side, it doesn't look like there's any scratches or dents or dings anywhere. Inside door panel looks good. Just as the first time I've seen it. I got some cleaner for this. It looks like there's a little bit of spots on there. Uh, I knew that from the pictures. I could clean that off, but this is the suede seats like I wanted with the leather, Trailhawk badging, everything like I wanted. Smells okay. Doesn't smell like it's ever been smoked in, which is great. Yeah, that looks good. Got a little bit of dirt here. I mean, it's dirty. It needs to be clean. It's got the all-weather floor mats. You can see the Grand Cherokee floor mats there. That's cool. Little scratch there. That's definitely a pretty good gouge. 
that was not on the description but uh pretty good gouge there wonder what i can do maybe take a permanent marker and fill that in a little bit but it's got the original manual it's got the papers okay nice screen shifter it's got the up down oh the keys are probably in the in that metal thing on the window but it's got the uh sunroof this is the um hard cover for the sunroof which is good on the explorer it had like a vinyl fabric covering because it rolled up in the back and when you had the windows down when you were driving it would be flap 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 would make a bunch of noise flapping against here i'm glad this is a hard cover that's great uh looks like it's got a little bit of something spilled here i'll have to get that out on here too okay uh, the driver's seat looks okay nothing wrong in there a little bit of dirt there i can get that off again you got your floor mats there uh memory seats got your seats in the back doesn't look like anybody's ever been back there okay you got the uh floor mat in the back too let's go check out the back door back seat Okay, door panel good, no scratches or anything. Good there. Okay, there's the back seats. Okay, that's good. Good there, everything looks fine. Let's see if it folds. No issues there. Uh, the back is pretty cool, it's got the subwoofer back there. Yeah, looks like it's nice, got the speakers in the back. Pretty cool see how this is this is good uh, it's just dirty right there and wipe that down it's not gouged or anything seats look good nothing's gouged nothing's scratched no tears or scrapes anywhere good condition not bad not bad not bad Let's see what else we got all right got the trailhawk badge that's nice and i was able to open up the back hatch came up no issues there um, automatically so that's cool i got the leds to replace these so that's good so again we got the tinted window in the back uh, tinted windows all around let's see what we have here okay we have the full size spare we have the two compartments i have extra compartments here if you guys um if you guys need one let me know i have an extra one of these and an extra one of these uh from the previous vehicle i did not trade it in with them on so um yeah looks cool it doesn't come with the uh flashlight here i think that's i didn't know that so that's different but yeah looks good of course this is clean as it's ever going to be because of the dog hair it's going to be in it but uh let's go ahead and shut this it just barely misses that other truck but it does doesn't make it whoa okay it's good all right all right this door panel looks good love that like semi wood grain synthetic wood grain stuff there that's really cool yeah the red stitching it doesn't have red stitching in the back which i thought was pretty odd um i thought it had red stitching everywhere but these are just like the laredo seats at that point they're not stitched but the front sure are that's that's for sure so we got it here all right trailhawk on this that's cool nice here nice all right it's got uh the information of where it's coming from all right very cool hey guys so that's the first look at the grand cherokee trailhawk we're gonna do some mods to this thing so make sure you hit that subscribe bell like this video and again always more to come with this truck so uh can't wait to get started let the ventures begin all right guys we'll see you